Hey, good people. I am talking to you from my bathroom. I'm sick, so I'm just trying to get some steam up in my system. I'm tired as hell. Just finished wrapping some gifts, putting up a motherfucking Christmas tree I ain't want to put, um, put up. But I had to talk to you guys about some real shit. Um, so everyone knows Cardi B had announced on Instagram that her and her man are breaking up, divorcing, I don't know, but definitely breaking up. She, yeah, so, yeah, they're not together and they stunned the internet. Okay, whatever. It's only been a year of marriage. Who knows how long they actually known each other. They got a baby, baby culture, blah, blah, blah. So check this out. So now it's a hashtag going around talking about um, hashtag take or set back. So we have these dumbass black rappers that get on my motherfucking nerves. The main cheating, nasty, raw sex having ass motherfuckers. Why do black women, and I can't speak, or women of color, always have to take all the abuse and all this other nonsense? Now I can't speak for any of um, white women. I don't can't I don't consider myself a feminist because I don't know what the fuck that is. Every year is something different, and basically it doesn't support black women to me. I feel it's for white women, white feminists. That's their movement. That's not my movement because I have I come from a whole different type of struggle. My struggle is with our beautiful black men that say some nonsense like take a cheating piece of shit like offset back. I was rooting for them. I'm not going to lie. I was rooting for them. Maybe, hopefully, he'll chill the fuck out. But he can't because he loves them South African bitches. And I don't blame him because them bitches are gorgeous. But I can't. I'm so tight. Why do we have to put up with the nonsense all the fucking time? Just like everyone's still going, a lot of black men are still going in on Sierra because she don't fuck with Future no more. Because Future, Future's like the, the king of these niggas. And he can barely speak English, let alone fucking rap. And I know he done birthed a lot of these rappers, but I don't give a fuck. I am so sick and tired of us having to, having to deal with someone who treats us like garbage. Fucking Cardi B got a case because of this nigga, and y'all telling her to take this nigga back? What the entire fuck? He's tweeting, talking about he misses her, and all this other bullshit. 50 Cent underneath her comments talking about, you look pretty, but nah, chill, no divorce, go home, and all this other stuff. T.I. said some bullshit. It was, no, I fucking... Share this shit on Facebook because I'm totally and absolutely disgusted with the simple fact. Why? Why do we got to put up with this nonsense? And if she did the same thing, she be, she's all type of whole slut, bitches, cunts, all that other shit, right? I thought, it's a thing going around. Where the fuck this shit is at? Little Duval, which is another nigga that, that he's so problem, problematic. I cannot stand him sometimes with his stupid ass. Um... Life too short to be leaving niggas just because they cheated. I don't know who needs to hear this, but he added Cardi B. Tomorrow is not prize. Um, tomorrow's not hashtag. Tomorrow's not problems. Take off that back. Hashtag take off that back. Trouble Man Thirty One, aka Ti Tip Harris, says I totally agree. Hashtag take off that back. Why are you rallying around this bullshit? Doesn't she deserve better? This is why motherfucking Sierra said level up. She did the ultimate level up when she got with Russell Wilson. Is that his name? Whatever the fuck. She, oh, that was the ultimate level up. That man made her into the first, not even made her. He partnered up. They built, they built something together. She's the first black MLB owner, like part owner. They have a beautiful family together. He makes her happy. I don't care how corny he is. He loves that girl. I don't even know these people. But just how he looks at her, how she looks at him. They're in love. They love each other. They have a beautiful family. And people call her, she's fucked up for leaving future. A nigga who got 10 baby mamas. This nigga got like 6 baby mamas and had the nerve to have babies after Sierra. Really? Really, future? And you want Cardi B to take it like 
I'm not surprised that it ended. I'm surprised it ended so quickly, honestly, because he's known for cheating like strippers. He like this. He trying to have threesomes and shit. Have a threesome where he be. She got no problem with that. I'm sure you have already done it anyway. I feel like she's the type of chick that she would do anything for him. And she a freaking nasty bitch. And I like her. And I see where she at. So what the fuck? Why the fuck? I just don't. I just. I'm just so dumbfounded. Why do we have to put up with the bullshit? We not strong if we put up with the bullshit. Oh, I see. Because Cambella said that she's been with someone for nine years. So and she waited for a ring after all the bullshit he's put up through. Oh, I see. Because. Um, Chrissy waited 12 years to be with Jimmy and still not married because that's the man she want to be. That's fine if that's something that you want to do, but don't promote that bullshit on other people. Don't tell, oh, well, they stayed and this one stayed and this one held down. I know bitches hold, holding niggas down in fucking prison and nothing. For what? For what? At the end of the day, he coming out of the prison doing what? To cheat on her some more? Like, what the... Oh, God, we got to get it together. Black women, women of color do not have allies. Why the fuck do we have to put up with the bullshit, with the cheating, the constant cheating and having bitches I got to scrap with and shit? Why do, oh, I don't do that shit. But I'm just saying, women out here doing that. And yes, we do have minds of our own and we make those choices. But why would you even want Anybody that you love and care about go through something like that. T.I., you got fucking daughters. You want the, you want your daughters to be cheated on constantly over and over and over again? Little Duval, I don't know if you got kids, but do you want that? You, Little Duval, you can't say that because you got a wife and a girlfriend. You, so you should be happy with your little scrawny ass. Oh, I can't. I just had to rant a little bit about that and clear up my nostrils. Or whatever. Let me know what you think about this whole bullshit about taking Offset back. Fuck that nigga. Shit. All she gotta worry about is her money, getting her shows, and making sure her baby girl is good. That's it, Cardi B. That is it.